Today's topic is on types of collisions that we'll be talking about during our Momentum and Energy Unit. Uh, this is the homework that is due on Friday, January 17th for all periods. All right, the first uh, kind of collision that we want to talk about is the elastic collision, which is when two objects collide and bounce off of each other. So hopefully, when you hear the word elastic, you should think of the word bounce, um, thinking maybe of like elastic bouncy balls or a rubber band and how it bounces back. Right, so in a collision that's elastic, uh, the objects collide and immediately bounce off of each other. So this is kind of similar to um, this idea of billiard balls or pool balls. Um, when you have um, one billiard ball go towards this whole group of them, what ends up happening is they all, it, sorry, it hits and then all of these go in different directions. They bounce off um, and they spread out throughout the entire billiard table. The second type of collision that we want to think about is called the perfectly inelastic collision. And this is when two objects collide and stick together. So if we imagine in a car accident, um, I have two cars going towards each other, they collide, and then um, they stick together. So they might continue sliding one way, um, but they're going to be stuck together. The last type of collision that we want to talk about is the partially inelastic collision, uh, which is when one or both um, objects in a collision get deformed. So let's say, uh, again, we have a collision, so an automobile accident, and so these ones collide, um, but during this collision, let's say this blue car um, gets deformed. This is going to be representative of my deforming. <laughs> right? So they collide together, and then they still bounce off. So this time they don't stick together, um, but now my blue car is a different shape. All right? it, when it crashed, it kind of got dented in. So there are three different types of collisions that we talked about, uh, and they kind of go along a spectrum um, or a range of what happens. So in an elastic collision, all right, you should always think they bounce, right? So the objects bounce off of each other. In a perfectly inelastic collision, the objects uh, they stick together. So you should say think of sticky or sticking together. And uh, this middle one, the partially inelastic one, all right, it kind of falls in the middle between elastic and inelastic. Uh, this one is when the object deforms, um, otherwise known as changing shapes. That's all the information that you need for today. Make sure that you put your notes on page four of your booklet um, so that you are ready for your open note quiz. See you later.